Hello and welcome to another set of reading from Lotus Love Tarot 555. Thank you so much for joining us again. I, I always begin my readings by first saying thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all the love and support that you continue to give our channel, that you continue to give our Instagram uh, channel as well. And please make sure you go and follow us at Lotus Love Tarot 555. But I just want to always begin by telling you thank you. Now, this reading today is the love forecast. We do this once a month and you can apply this to your sun, your moon, your rising, and for some, even your Venus sign. Now, remember that the messages do flip-flop. So if it doesn't relate to you, it will relate to your partner. Oh, and hello to our cross watchers out there. Now, I have already pre-shuffled and we can move quickly past that portion. And also, I have started daily readings. So make sure you tune in to us every day. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit that little bell right there so you can get the daily notifications. But I'm quite sure just having that insight on what to expect in that day is going to really begin to help you out a lot because I know it has already blessed me and has already blessed several that have uh, watched the dailies and have even you know gone as far as to get the extended which goes just a little bit further into the situations that are occurring all right um i think i already said make sure you follow us on instagram and also don't forget that with these readings there's no time limit so it could have happened three months ago it could happen today it could happen in the near future all right i love you guys so much and now on to your reading Hello, my Aries. Let's get right into your reading. And your reading from, what is this? June. Your reading from May was, what is going on with this? So apparently something was going on with that situation. And let's just see where we are now for your love forecast for June 2019. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to to go for for the sign of Aries as it relates to the love for us. What do they need to know in love for June 2019? Okay. Any more messages for the sign of Aries as it relates to love for June 2019? All right. Okay, my Aries. Okay, Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to go for for the sign of Aries as it relates to the love forecast for June 2019? What's going on with Aries in love for June 2019? Oh, we got a serious flyer here. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator, and that's what messages need to go for for the sign of Aries. And love, for our love for past for June 2019. What messages need to go for for the sign of Aries? Aries, you are not playing about these messages this month. They are coming out. Okay, Holy Spirit, Divine Creator, and universe, what messages need to go for for the sign of Aries? As it relates to the love forecast for June 2019. <laughs> wow. All right. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe. What messages need to go forth for the sign of Aries as it relates to the love forecast for June 2019? <laughs> Unbelievable. I mean, the messages really came out. Okay, first card out. Wedding. All right, this situation involves marriage. Now, this could relate to anything, and let me explain this. Um, with this wedding card, for those uh, that are single, someone could be coming in that is going to be your uh, husband, your wife, okay? For those who are in a relationship, your relationship could be deepening. It could be going to the level of a marriage. You could actually be receiving a proposal for uh, for marriage. Uh, you could be moving in together. Okay, this love situation could be surrounded around somebody who is married. So we need to look a little further into this to see how wedding is relating. But your next card, by these being coupled together, express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. So some watching this, you may be the one who is going to make the proposal of marriage, okay? Or you may be the one who is going to take the relationship to a deeper level. Maybe, you know, by having some, some talks or some conversations. 
Then your next card says worthiness. Know that you deserve to receive good in all ways. Good in all ways in everything that you're doing. And Spirit says, use your imagination and you'll see the answer. So the answer is there. The answer is there, but you're going to have to look a little deeper within yourself to see what the answer is. And somebody's getting into business. Could be with this uh, love interest over here. Trust and follow through on a new business idea or career opportunity. Okay? And Spirit says, just trust me. I got you. Just trust me in this. I have you. All right. So let's just see what we're doing. Holy Spirit, the Holy of the universe. What messages need to go forth for the sign of Aries as it relates to love for June 2019? What's going on in love for the sign of Aries? Oh, wow. Okay. Any more messages for the sign of Aries? Okay, any more messages? Okay. All right, Aries, let's see what's going on here. Okay, 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 okay. All right. All right, okay, my Aries, you have uh, Temperance, which is Sagittarius. You have the Devil, which is Capricorn. And you have Bronze, a lot of fire energy here. So it looks like it's a lot of fire and sex going on with this. You have uh, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Okay, that is represented. But remember, I told you it doesn't have to be that sign. It could be taken on the energy of that sign. But it's a lot of fire happening in this message, which could also represent you. Okay, my Aries, coming right out of the box, you had temperance, the devil, the fool, knight of wands, your overarching energy is the Ten of Wands, okay? So you have been burdened, you've been stressed, and this is probably a carryover from that Meg reading. Um, you just really couldn't take any more, okay? You were at the end of carrying your burdens. You couldn't carry any more burdens, okay? Uh, and so temperance has arrived. So this, is, this tells me that you're moving in a better place right now. You're balanced. Uh, when you look at temperance, this is harmony. Look at his foot in the, in the water, the angel's foot in the water. And so this is having patience now. I mean, you're, you're calming yourself now because I feel like you're over these addictions. Whatever this could be, this could be materialism. Um, this could be an addiction of some type. You know, could be drugs, could be alcohol, could be shopping, could be, um, you know, anything that is definitely is bringing you down. It's keeping you in a very low vibrational state. This even could be greed. It could be sex. It could be, you know, having lust, wanting too much, okay? But you're, you're, you're starting over. You, you got a new path coming. When you think of the fool, the fool is new beginning, fresh start, you know, new hope. You know, it's the beauty of taking a chance. Okay, so all of this is, is going in the right direction because I got a feeling that Spirit is saying you're starting with this balance here because you realize it's materialistic things, this place that you were, you have to leave this behind. You're going on, on, on a new path at this point. You're going new. And with this Knight of Wands, you could be dealing with a player player. <laughs> but I know that we, uh, we're we looking at this wedding. So I'm looking at this card from a sense of just a lot of sex going on. It's a lot of sex going on, okay, with this Knight of Wands. This is a free-spirited person, but uh, they are very heavy in the sex, sex arena. So with this wedding ex and expressing your love, I got a feeling that um, somebody's going to be happy in June. <laughs> somebody's going to be happy in June, okay. Okay. All right, my Aries, that concludes your reading for uh, for June. But looks like, you know, you're on the right path. And um, don't forget to hit us for our daily readings, okay? They can be found on our channel. And they're actually under the daily reading um, playlist, okay? All right. Until next time, my loves. Bye-bye.